All right, y'all, welcome back to Random Recess. It's Abed and Chris here, and we are back on board the Disney Wish on Pirate Night. That's right, it's still day three. It's nighttime now, and it's Pirate Night here on the Wish. We have dinner at Arendelle. We're going to watch some pirate shows and some fireworks tonight, too. We also have a surprise. We may have played trivia. I guess you'll have to find out. Keep watching. I don't know. There's a there's a clue on a bet's head. Spoiler alert. Arg. We're going to go join Mickey's Pirate Game. Don't know what time it is. It's time to hit the high seas. And it's recess time. Let's go. Donald, how are you? How's it going? You look great, by the way. Much better outfit than what I'm wearing. Ah, you. Can we get a picture? All right. All right. Oh, like this. There we go. All right, y'all. Tonight, if you haven't guessed it, Chris and I are eating at Arendelle. Part of the rotational dining, and this is our night. That's right, Arendelle, a frozen dining experience. We're here to celebrate Anna and Kristoff's engagement. On pirate night, so it should be interesting. That's cool. This will be fun. So you walk in, everything is heavily themed. It's absolutely amazing in here. Oh, congratulations, Queen Anna. Congratulations, Queen Christoph. Anna and Kristoff, your pals Olaf and Sven. All right, so as you enter Arendelle, the Arendelle restaurant, you go down this super long hallway. It's adorned with like chandeliers that are flickering, uh, all these portraits of all the Frozen characters. It's really cute. So this is a family dining experience. You're seated at big, long tables. In the middle of the room is a stage where they're going to put on a production during dinner. So there's going to be singing and dancing, uh, lots of entertainment, just like a big celebration would be. So excited to see what this is about. It's gotten rave reviews from everybody that's done it. We'll see how the food is, and I'm sure the entertainment's going to be amazing. I don't have a pirate costume. But it's Pirates Night, so this is the closest we got. Little Goonies shirt. Right? Goonies never say die. There we go. One of my favorite movies of all time. Alright, so the menu tonight is very kind of like Eastern European themed. A lot of like Nordic dishes, right? Or Nordic inspired dishes. The things that a lot of people like are the, the big scallop. A lot of carbs going on this meal. And I'm okay with that. in this part of the world, it is time for the skull! Yes, the skull! <laughs> but I don't have a skull. Olaf, a skull is a celebratory toast, and with Anna and Kristoff's engagement, I'm sure we have plenty to celebrate. Oh, you definitely do! So, everyone, raise the class star! Queen Anna and Kristoff! <laughs> Hey guys, this would be a great time to give this video a thumbs up and maybe even a subscribe. It helps us out a lot and it's free. We're a small channel and we're growing fast, so we'd love to have you along for the ride. We have tons of good recesses coming up, so stay tuned. All right, the wishing star is red tonight for Pirates Night. All right, Mickey and Minnie's Pirates in the Caribbean is about to start. Are you all excited for the pirate festivities to begin? Party like a pirate! Put your hands together for Captain Minnie and Mickey's Pirate Tunnel! Crew, Pirate Tunnel! Pirate Daisy! 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 Scoped out our spot for the 1015 Rockin' Pirate Show and Fireworks. Definitely recommend getting here early because it will fill up. I think the best way to watch it is on the second level, so deck 12, on the right side of the stage because the fireworks are gonna shoot over the boat and go off on the, uh, the right side of the stage as you're looking at it. So that's where we are. You're gonna get an unobstructed view of the fireworks over here. 
Um, that way, like, the, the aqua mouse isn't in your way. So, yeah, you gotta get here early, though, to scope out a spot. Fireworks at sea, that was rocking. That deserves a like, come on. Where else are you gonna see fireworks on the open ocean on a cruise ship? Only on a Disney cruise. That was fantastic. Definitely get there early, because you need to find a spot. But yeah, it's totally worth it. It was so well done. And yeah, Disney just loves its fireworks, doesn't it? And its cruises are no exception, so don't miss out. Welcome to 2000's Music Trivia, how we doing? Yay! Excellent. Okay, are we excited for some trivia then? Yeah. Yes. We decided to pop in to 2000's music trivia, so let's see how it goes. We just got out of 2000's music trivia. It was named that tune, and Abed and I got a perfect score, but we lost on the tiebreaker because there was also another team that got a perfect score, so we didn't win. But we did get a consolation prize, which is the same as the first place prize. Loki kind of wanted the medal, but that's fine. We still <laughs> we didn't get the little rubber medal, but we'll try for that tomorrow. As for today, got a little prize goodie bag. So it's this cotton tote, which is actually pretty nice. DCL cotton tote. Open it. Oh, what's in it? Bam! DCL hat. That's pretty nice. That's a cool hat. And. Got like a little journal, like a little notepad. Yeah, so you can like journal in here. Fidget spinner. Who doesn't love those? And last but not least, you see our keychain. All in all, not a bad haul. Forgetting some songs, right? Loki wanted the medal, but that's fine. <laughs> we'll take this. It was a fun trivia. And uh, we, we'll just try another trivia tomorrow. There's lots of trivia tomorrow. So not a bad haul. And y'all know I love hats, so I'm already wearing mine. We got two bags. All right, so we're here at Bayou, which is the Princess and the Frog themed bar and lounge. They play live music in here sometimes too. And it's really cool in here. The creations are all uh, Bayou themed. And of course the menu is very like New Orleans-y themed. I got a Sazerac, a bed got a Hurricane. And of course we had to order beignets. So those are coming. This is one of the few bars on the ship that's actually open late. So this is open till 1 a.m. And Hyperspace Lounge is the other one that's open till 12.30. Everything else closes around 10. It's not a lot of people up drinking really late, but the bayou is open pretty late, so we've decided to stop by and probably finish the night out. So I ordered a hurricane. It's not quite the right color, but I gotta say this really tastes close to the Pat O'Brien's uh, hurricane. So if you're looking for something like as close as you can get, order the hurricane here at the bayou. As far as the beignets go, I think the Disney beignets in general, they're good. But they really require, it's all about the dipping sauce, like the beignet with the caramel or the chocolate or whatever sauce comes with it. That's when they really excel. Um, New Orleans beignets don't need anything. I mean, of course, powdered sugar, but that goes without saying. But yeah, a good choice and really inexpensive snack on a very expensive cruise.
things. Till next time, we'll see you on the next recess. Bye, everyone. Bye.